In today's video we see the making of everyone's favorite perfume. The first step in making a perfume is making the glass bottles needed for it. For this, a mixture of silica and other chemicals is added to the molten mixture and the mold is placed inside it and air is blown vigorously. Thus these bottles are formed in the correct shape. Bottles can be produced in any number of ways by changing the different shapes of the mold. These are heated and cooled several times to make them not break easily. Now there will be quality inspection of all these bottles. Each company carefully checks and ensures that these bottles have the specified length, size and quality. Next these bottles should be printed with colorful painting images and designs. For that, they are passed through a computer controlled painting machine and painted as required. After it is thoroughly dried, it is released to the next station. Now the name logo of the perfume brand should also be printed on these bottles. Usually all these are done through screen printing. But if any large images are to be printed on these bottles, it can be done through laser printing with the help of computer. Now the most important component of this is the production of perfume. A perfume is made by extracting the oils of flowers and other spices through a process called maceration and then mixing them with ethanol. This process takes place in large steel tanks with great precision. The more time and labor it takes to do this, the more expensive the perfume will be. Now the prepared glass bottles are filled by injecting the perfume inside. After that, the spraying nozzle and other parties are taken inside it. It is pressed under a pressing machine and sealed in the bottle in such a way that there is no leakage. Then the lids will also be closed. If metallic bottles are used instead of glass, they are first filled with perfume using a machine. Meanwhile, the nozzle part used for spraying with an automatic feeder will place the machine itself inside the bottle. At the next station, a compressor is used to increase the high pressure inside the bottle. Put the cap on top and the perfume bottle is ready. Now these will be packed and sent to the shops. How was the factory production of perfume? Please comment below and let me know. Also let us know the manufacturing operations of the goods you would like to see. Definitely doable. Thanks for watching.